Timing accurately. There are many scientific experiments that involve timing. It is important to consider techniques that enable timing to be carried out as accurately as possible. There is a selection of equipment available for timing. The stopwatch is the most commonly used piece of science classroom timing equipment. Most stopwatches have a number of display modes that it is possible to switch between. Once in timing mode, the stopwatch has a start-stop button and a reset button. Common timing experiments involve either moving trolleys or oscillations. Timing one oscillation has a large percentage error due to the effect of human reaction times. First, one oscillation must be defined. This is usually taken as the time for the oscillating item to move from one most extreme point to the other and back again. To eliminate parallax error, it is important to be face on to and at the same level as the oscillating object. To time oscillations accurately, you calculate a mean average oscillation time. To do this, time how long 20 or more oscillations take. And then divide through to get the time for one oscillation. When timing a moving trolley, it is important to consider potential errors and attempt to eliminate them. If the trolley is moving down a ramp, the force applied to get the trolley moving must be constant. To ensure this is the case, draw a start line across your ramp. Place the trolley on this line in a manner that can be repeated. The trolley can then be released rather than push started with a potentially variable force. Ensuring that timing ends at the same point for each trolley run is the next challenge. Draw a finish line on the ramp a known distance from the start line. To minimise the effect of error due to reaction times, this distance should be as long as is practical. Remaining errors in this experiment may relate to parallax or the uneven surface of the ramp. To eliminate parallax and reaction time errors, light gates can be used. To do this, the trolley may need to be adapted or a different trolley may be necessary. Attaching the light gate to a data logger and computer software allows collection of more reliable, accurate and precise data. Light gates can be used in a variety of ways to improve timing. They can also be set up vertically for timing falling objects.